Hello guys, welcome to today's video by Trust Stanley and this is a TS Tech Talk video. So guys, I want to show you how to contact um, the Facebook support if you're having any issue with your Facebook page and this can easily be faced by contacting the Facebook support. Now, um, before I start this video, um, most of you guys might be having issue opening the Meta Business Suite. Now, let me go ahead and open the Facebook um, Facebook.com, which is normally where you can easily open. Now, um, you have to go ahead and switch your account to your business page. Now, if you are currently switched to your personal page, um, click on this account area and then click on see profile and then select your business page, which is actually that particular business page that you want to access. Now, if you have that business page open, it's going to bring you to this particular area. Now, if you are on this home page, make sure you are on the home page. You are going to see an option that says business manager. Now, when you click on business manager, this is going to navigate you to the Facebook business suite, or you can call it the meta business suite. So when you click on it, it loads up. And I want to show you guys eventually how we locate to this page, although I'm going to do that on a different video so that um, most people can actually understand how to navigate and go to that area. So when you bring you to this particular area, the first thing you need to do is to click on this drop down area and select the particular page. And note guys, the account that I want to make use of is the TS Tech Talk. So I'm going to go ahead and select that and it's going to load up the TS Tech Talk. The reason why it displayed that particular profile or the account you saw just now is because that particular account is actually um, a different Facebook page account. So after it loads up, um, click on this little icon right here and then you just click on page post, right? Um, when you click on the page post, it's going to take you the to the post section of the um, Facebook business suite. So click on that and then you notice it says go to the Facebook business suite. Go ahead and click on confirm. It's going to navigate and take you to the business suite, which is currently this particular area where I was before. So wait for it to load up. It's going to take a while. And almost done. Actually, this should be faster if you have a good internet. So I always click on dismiss on this because I already know whatever it wants to um, show me. So I'm going to click on done. So it actually brings you to this particular area. So usually um, when you click on home page, um, that is actually where I was previously. I was on the home page. Wait for it to load up. It's going to load. All right, guys. So this has loaded successfully and this is actually where it brought us. So the next thing you need to do to contact your Facebook support is to click on this area where it says help. Now, when you click on that area, you are going to notice this particular area. Um, I hope you guys are seeing my mouse currently is on the bottom left. So click on help and wait for the help to load up. So this is actually going to load on the right hand area of your screen. You can notice there is this loading icon. So wait for it to load. It's going to loop and completely load up for you. So guys, when this load up is going to bring this, it's going to display all of this common information. And if for some reason you can go ahead and click on this area to search for more information. But for my case, I'm going to scroll down and um, you can notice previously, this is what I actually um, went and, and, and have actually submitted. So I'm going to scroll down even further and I'm going to actually enter in the particular guide or the particular issue I want. So all you need to do is to click on create a new case and it's going to start a new case for you. On default, it's going to select your page. So um, usually it's going to ask you what issue you're currently having. So you have to select a particular issue you are having and you have to select something relating to this area. And you can easily type on it to search for it. But I would advise you guys not to tap. Just go ahead and search for it by scrolling. It's actually not far. Scroll through and look for a one that is particularly particularly relating to your issue. If there is no one here, just go ahead and select anything at random. And when you choose it at random, um, I'm going to actually look for a one. I have an issue creating a timeline on my post. I actually don't have any of those issue, but I'm just going to choose that. So um, go ahead and read and then select a particular one. So on default, it's going to give you a particular article to read. So when you are not interested on the article, um, probably you read it and you are, it actually didn't solve your issue. Go ahead and click on contact support. Now, when you click on contact support, it's going to give you different information. And guys, before I continue on this um, video, um, there is a quick information you have actually have to know. Make sure you are contacting Facebook support 
between the working days of Monday to Fridays. Do not contact them on the Saturdays. Do not contact them on the weekend. Saturdays and Sunday are off. And if you are contacting them, depending on where you are contacting them from, make sure you are contacting Facebook support from 8 p.m. to um, at least 4, um, 4 p.m. Sorry, from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Make sure you contact them within that particular period. If not, um, it's actually a waste. So the next thing you need to do is to select um, chat and then type in some information. Make sure that your phone number is actually correct and then click on start chat. Now, um, this is actually how it goes. When you start the chat, automatically it's going to start you with a bot. So when a bot asks you different question, answer the bot and then eventually go ahead and select that you want to speak with a support so it's going to um you want to speak with an online support it's going to now navigate you to the online support and very soon a support is going to join you and you will start chatting with them i actually had a very long conversation with the support and um at the point they also have to call me on phone and it was very easy and it was very friendly and it was able to solve my issue so um this is all i need to show you guys because i do not want to start making video and showing you guys um how to start a chat where i'm actually not having any um genuine issue so i'm sorry i didn't make the video when i was trying to start the chat with the support so um guys yeah this is just how to start a support sorry i didn't go ahead and start a support fully but this is actually going to work it out for you but if you're having any issue or maybe trying to contact support and you're having any issue please leave it on the comment section and um, um if you actually need an assistant with a screenshot I will also be able to respond to you on my TikTok or, sorry, on my Instagram or on my Facebook page. So um, send me a screenshot if you're having any challenges and I'll be able to respond to that. And guys, this is all I want to say on today's video. If you have any question, you know what to do, Facebook um, or Instagram. So thank you guys for watching the video. I hope it's helpful. If it is, please smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video. I will see you guys on my next video. Please stay safe and peace.